So, referee's grip. You want to go over, right? Shoulder. Bring that shoulder in. Arms are getting closed. Don't We're getting move. go. ready to go. And quick explosive start. Sarah tried to, tried to get the elbow foul for a restart. 1-0, Nisa Jamadan. I think Sarah a little bit missed, missed, missed the go, missed the command. Maybe she will do better in the second round. No moving, no moving. It's not easy for Sarah to pull against uh, Nisa, who, who is very technical. And at the age of 19, I would say very experienced, very experienced arm wrestler. When you pull the hardest tournaments, and we know like the level in Turkish arm wrestling is so more. high, just uh, the no mass more. of arm wrestlers they have there in their nationals uh, or some tournaments, it's crazy. So you have a lot of experience pulling. And then move. Round number two. Let's see where this goes. Oh, Nisa is, up. Nisa is load. loading up. Nisa Catches is loading up at what Sara had to do. Can you see? Pin. Elbow. No? So I think elbow foul for Nisa. Okay. And that's. If, if you are too much stronger, it's possible. No but if you are more or less even, the one who will hold usually. Go! And exploding. Trying re grip. This time elbow Referees is on are the looking, pad. looking for elbows. One foul for Sarah Collins. One foul to each athlete. Referee Bill so Collins is closing a group. A lot of chances of pulling. Again, Nisa is loading up. Move, go! Yes. grip. B gripping. What do we have? Oh, elbow foul for Nisa. No moving. We no see moving. the concentration on Sarah's face. Don't move, go! Much better from Sarah. First time taking one foul, one warning. One warning. Oh no, two fouls. Two fouls to each of the athletes. Round number two is going crazy. I think she saw some kind of opening. She feels like she's in the match. No Let's see if she can keep this momentum going. Don't move. Go! I believe much better from Sarah. Taking over, taking over the hand, pulling down, pulling down, not letting Nisa, Nisa. It's Elbow! Like Elbow! Elbow! Push it! Push it! Second referee. She is still, still there on the side, still she is there on pushing. the side. She is pushing. No. I was pushing this way. That's how her hand was. I got an elbow fall. Discussion is about. I feel so we are the no, I called it first. It I called the elbow. Because in arm wrestling, it's not allowed to push intentionally opponent, and it's not Longer easy matches, to escape. Longer matches, we know they do not complement the faster arm wrestler, the more explosive one. No moving, There's a reason why you are explosive. Your fast twitch fibers are there. Maybe scarred, not scarred. slow twitch. Scarred, you got turning. Sarah, she's she's still there. She still looks very confident. Don't move, go! Much better for Nisa. She was wow. Rolled over, she get the control scarred. of the pronator, went to the side. That's experience, <laughs> and that's what's happening when you have Engin Terzi in a corner, and she changed position from going backwards, she changed position, and she went with active wrist, with active hand, and uh, finishes it with good. Right here, boom! There's a lot of people who just wants to be very, very fresh. They just need to stay fresh. And uh, longer it goes, more it favors the armister who doesn't like that. Who needs to be a little bit, who needs to take their time to warm up. I feel like, is that an elbow, not elbow foul, but moving in a referee's grip foul? It should be a foul. It should be a foul. Did, we just don't so, see referee. I didn't so sign from. Yeah, I don't see referee. No moving, girls. Let's, we'll continue. Scarf. Don't move. Go! Wow. Wow. What happened here? I believe Nisa took much lower grip. She felt that hand control is there and she doesn't need to fight for, for the height. Okay, but he take a lower lower grip. He take a deeper grip. He controlled Sars Pronator. That round three looked so dominant. I don't know how much or what can she do. No moving, girls. No moving. Closing the hands. No pulling against the center. And just wow. 
Yeah, Nisa, Nisa understood she doesn't need to load up. She just needs to stay in the center. No moving. And the referee, let's see. Nisa looks no very move. confident. Go! Boom, so fast. I think referees will think it was a slip in losing position. I think it was. My hand did not come out. Even open if it wasn't, the close. elbow was off the pad. And went below the pad. Definitely, Sarah was trying to. Can we see a replay on this for this one, please? Get away from five yes. and it's four, four zero. Four zero. Nisa Jamadan secures the victory. The the table, There's a little bit right. arguing. No, you can't. She was on your side. She, I was over no, here. It was on this right. side. Okay, the referee is going to take a look at the replay. Okay, straps. Wow. Okay, good sportsmanship. Yeah. So it's, we are back we to 3 0. We're back to 3 0. Like the match pen. isn't over. Sarah was fighting her battle. And she, so she, gets a better she match. double checked okay. the video with the referees. And yeah. Just hold it right here for me, girls. What will be the game plan for this one? I'm, but, but, like, it's not all my Shoulders a little bit backwards. Hold it. Hold I think Nisa will try to do the same thing. Closer. Just uh, copying side pressure, protecting the pronator. No moving. A little bit of rising from Nisa. We can see it. We can no see move. it. Move. Go! Full control. Full control. <laughs> Good job. Mm. Nisa Jamadan secures the victory. 4 0. Victory. I'm interested to see what the girls will try to do now. And top straight to the referee's grip. No moving, girls. No moving. Maybe they could go straight to straps as well. No move. Go! Yes, yes. Wow. Wow. No. Yeah, that's a pin for Nisa because the go. arm was on her side. So this is an interesting thing in arm wrestling. You, it's not an interesting thing, it's just the thing. You cannot be pinned. You cannot be pinned on your side of the of the table from the center. So, even though Sarah's arm was on top, it was on Nisa's side. Nisa was getting off the center. So, gets on Nisa's side, she pulls down, and then a slip. I would give given us, yeah. I would give given a strap, oh, okay, yeah. Oh, well, that was low, yeah. yeah. Those Thank are you. great replays, I love it. Round number six. Nisa Chamadan 5-0 over Sarah Collins. I would I would try no more opposite. I would try to sit a little bit back, to lay back, to use more of her Rise back pressure. Up. Move, go! Yeah. Yeah. Pulls back. Nisa Chamadan takes the win. I can't feel it. So you are good job. You did good. Good job, thank you. First round in the straps. It's good side hit from Nisa. Second round, without the straps, Nisa is taking control of Sara's hand and wrist and didn't let her to sleep. It's, it's elbow fall and then in this round three and round four, Nisa changed her style and he was focusing much, for, much more on Sara's pronator. And I could have to say that Every round, every round, Nisa was using her experience and her ability to pull in a different styles. That was very, very impressive. What happened in round number two? Uh, I've made so much mistakes. I didn't exactly listen to my coach. That's why I like, had a hard time. I should have listened to him from the start, but after that, it was easier. Uh, was anything surprising? Was she what you expected on the table? Actually, it was so surprising. I didn't expect that much strong fingers, but, but the rest was like I expected, as I expected. Round number three, you got really comfortable. You like you're in charge. You're in a cruise mode. Does it felt like that? Uh, I don't want to say that much, but it was easy for me. Easy. Exactly. So, how do you rate your King of the Table debut? Uh, I don't want to rate, but like it was not easy as I expected. Yes, thank you.